Welcome to our show, Future Trends. Today, the mystery of antimatter, does it fall up or down? Have you ever wondered what would happen if you took a piece of antimatter in your hand and let it go? Would it fall down, like everything we know? Or would it move in the opposite direction? Today, we dive into the fascinating world of antimatter and unveil what a groundbreaking experiment at CERN has discovered. Antimatter is, in many ways, the exact opposite of everything we're familiar with. Since its discovery in 1932, scientists have speculated about how it would behave in a gravitational field. Does it get attracted like regular matter, or is there a surprising twist? Until recently, we only had theoretical assumptions about this. But the Alpha-G experiment at CERN has finally given us a clear answer. And guess what? Antimatter, specifically antihydrogen, does indeed fall down, just like regular matter. It might sound simple now, but this breakthrough has profound implications. It confirms Einstein's general theory of relativity, which states that all forms of matter, including antimatter, should be treated equally when it comes to gravity. But here's the catch. Although we now know that antimatter is attracted by gravity, we still don't know if it's attracted with the same strength as regular matter. That's the next big mystery to solve. Imagine what it would mean if we found out that antimatter reacts differently to gravity than regular matter. What do you think the implications would be for our understanding of the universe? And why do you believe it's so crucial to understand the behavior of antimatter? The discoveries of the Alpha-G experiment at CERN are a massive leap in our understanding of antimatter. It's an exciting age of discovery, and we're just getting started. Who knows what other secrets antimatter still holds for us? I hope you learned something new today and are as captivated by the wonders of antimatter as I am. Let's look forward together to more thrilling discoveries in this mesmerizing world. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please share it with your friends and family and don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Leave your thoughts and opinions in the comments. Until next time.